time to get collected. We're going to head down to Brittany Carroll. Brittany, what's going on in pit lane? Hi, guys. I'm down here with Chris, car chief and marketing manager of Black Sheep Racing. I noticed that we do have some old tires on the cars right now. Are we trying to be precautious in practice round? Yeah, absolutely. With the points lead, and we've got two weeks till we get to Austin for the final race of the year, we don't want to risk anything. This is a non-points event for us because we've already done our six. We opted to do the F1 race in Miami. So here, we're feeling the car out. We're just being very cautious and very careful. But we do expect her to pick up the pace a little bit in the next session. Good luck to you and the team. All right, and we say... It's Laura, he's talking about that. You know, when Chris says we, we expect her to pick up, we're talking about Laura Eli. Yeah. And um, I, I've gotten quite familiar with Laura, and I've absolutely really enjoyed watching her race this year. Uh, starting off earlier on in our USA West Series uh, out, out uh, at uh, WeatherTech Raceway, uh, I saw her that weekend have absolute hints of brilliance. And I've also saw her the same weekend do the opposite. And that being said, with the two of them, uh, they're going, you know, having some mistakes, spinning out, getting the lead back. I, I immediately thought, like, wow, this woman, she can really, really drive. And uh, so to have her out here and running so well and be leading the points, uh, that's that's a competitor that can win at any facility we go to. And that Black Sheep team, uh, they, they've really got a handle on what's going on. And so expect Laura, yes, to definitely get faster and faster. I've been watching her here by the times. Uh, not normally where you would see her, but... Once again, being very intelligent about what you're doing. This is a non-points race. This is just a, hey, I raced the Indianapolis Motor Speedway race for the, for her and the Black Sheep Racing Team. Yeah, and, and fair play to them for supporting the series in the event. Uh, and what you heard there from down in the pit lane, um, there is a finite number of races that you can do to score points. So I think it's not like drop scores, but right. but there is, in some ways, there was no point in them coming here, literally. Yeah. there was no points for them. Yep. Um, but that's not the way that they've looked at it. They've, they, they want to support, they want to come and drive here. And that black 09 with the uh, the red detailing on uh, Flora out on the circuit at the moment. And at the moment, as Sean said, sitting in 19th position overall. That is, uh, there's a few 992s ahead of her. I think she's getting close probably to the top 10 of, of the 991 category. The black sheep on the yeah, she, front she, is actually orange. She's a, I think she's up there by class, up there around 13 to 20. Well, but, but that's this is within reason on purpose. Yes. Like they said, you know, I, I, Laura, if, if Laura wants to get herself, break herself into the top 10, she's going to do it. Uh, if she wants to break herself in the top five, from what I've seen this year, that has not been an issue. So they're just being smart about what they're doing out here, especially in practice one. They don't want to wreck the car. They're going after a championship they're going to chase down in a few weeks in Texas. And also, very interesting, on all times. Yeah. Time